Greetings. This is Joseph Rowan of A Fool for Learning, and our foolish thought for today is well being washing. An article posted in the September 2023 issue of TD Magazine discussed the phrase well being washing. Now, what the heck is well being washing? Is it some sort of new age cleansing program adopted by businesses? owned by a Gen Zer? The answer is no. Well-being washing is, and I quote, the practice of claiming to support employees' well-being, such as on blogs, social media, or the company intranet, without providing any tangible support. It seems that the Institution of Occupational Safety and Health IOSH, not to be confused with the U.S. government agency OSHA, polled workers from 60 different countries in regards to well being washing. According to their survey, 51% of those who responded say, stated that their employer was guilty of this. So, is your employer guilty of well being washing? Are you guilty of this? Is this really a phenomenon among businesses? Or is this just something that someone made up because they were upset that their organization did not focus on the issues they were having? No matter what your response to my questions are, it is my hope that I gave you something to think about. If you learned something from this episode, please take a moment to like, comment, or subscribe to this channel. To learn more about A Fool for Learning and how I can assist you and your organization with an appropriate learning solution to meet your business needs, please visit my website at afoolforlearning.com. This is Joseph Barone, the CEO of A Fool for Learning, signing out. Remember, learn, perform, succeed.